I suffer from gadgetitis. Uh, I just love gadgets. If you love gadgets, check this little guy out. This monitors uh, voltage, current, capacity, power, load impedance, charging time, and uh, does a lot more as well. Uh, as you can see, it has standard USB in and out. It also has the type C in and out, and around the corner there, the micro USB connector. The fast charge types, uh, like the, the, the Qualcomm that I've got on this uh, adapter here, uh, also Android, the BC 1.2, Apple's protocols, Huawei, and the new power delivery protocols. But that's not all. It also comes with this Bluetooth module, so you can connect it not only to an app on your phone, but also to uh, an application on your PC. It's absolutely brilliant. Let's get the app installed and uh, see what that looks like. To do that, I'm going to be using this little OTG adapter. So let's get our USB stick installed in there. And now let's connect to our Bluetooth. So we can see the available device here. And one, two, three, four is the pin. And now we can see the, the data on our phone here. So uh, that looks neat. And let's take a look now at the PC application as well. Let's take a look at the PC software setup. So just bear in mind what the location is. Nothing we need to change there. So that's now finished. I had to track down the program as it wasn't uh, included on the list of installed programs for some reason. So just look on your path for the program files uh, in the x86 if you're on a 64-bit machine uh, for the folder UM24C. We need now to find our Bluetooth module. And we need to know what COM port it's using. So here in the device manager, we can see that it's assigned to COM port 10 and 3. Now, which one is it? RTFM. As we can see, we select the lower value, the lowest port in the list. So in our instance, that will be COM3. And we can see our values on the screen here. We can see that the unit is working in principle, so uh, now it's time to get some testing. Finally, a quick test. Uh, I'm going to fast charge my uh, Galaxy S6 here. And we can see the values changing here on the app, which is running on my old uh, S4. And we'll just leave that for a moment and see. We can see that it is um, fast charge enabled. Uh, if I look him here, we can see it's fast charging, uh, 27%, approximately one hour, and 
it's just over one amp here 1.160 and the resistance or impedance of the of the load of the phone is just 4.3 ohms so all of that looks to be good nice graphical representation there and uh, a really nice and useful gadget especially having the the pc interface as well where you can output the information to an excel spreadsheet uh, should you feel the need actually now the voltage has ramped up it's uh, nearly nearly nine volts now we can see it uh, represented on the on the graph there as well you can also see here that uh, although the current has remained pretty much the same with the increased voltage we're now getting uh, much more power into into the load and that's also reflected in the load's uh, impedance well, thanks a lot for watching and don't forget to uh, read the description and uh, give it a like